I'm back in the Midwest. I, I love being in Chicago, right? So I'm I'm Midwest girl through and through. So to be fighting in the Midwest again, you know, after fighting in Singapore and Toronto, Chicago feels like home. I'd have to say, well, that's a good one. I, you know what's crazy is I didn't have very many heroes growing up. I, I was a very um, happy little girl in that way. So like being my own hero was always super important to me. If I could always be my own hero and have my own back, then I knew that, I don't know, I guess I'd have to say me. I was my biggest hero growing up. My very first MMA fight, you know, I'd rented a UFC from Blockbuster and it was like Shamrock versus, I want to say one of the Gracies. And I remember seeing fighting and I was still in high school at that time. So I wasn't like completely like, oh, this is what I want to do. But it wasn't until I went to my first live event that I was like, I love fighting. This is so cool. After my first fight, I knew it. I just knew that this is what I was supposed to be doing with my life. Like it just felt right. I remember going into Strong Style, the gym I originally started out with, and everyone's like, wait a minute, this chick wants to fight? Like, girls don't want to fight. And I was like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm looking for an outlet in life. I didn't have the greatest upbringing, and I knew it had to be physical. I always played sports, and I wasn't, you know, I wasn't a top-level college athlete. So when I found fighting and, and did that, I was like, wait a minute, this is what I'm supposed to be doing. And everyone around me who was a little bit reluctant, I made them believers. So I started the tagline, you know, I believe because Anytime anybody was like, man, women fighting, like, I don't know about that. And I'm like, no, I believe. No, I really do. I, I, I believe that we're going to be something and I'm going to be something. And, you know, here I am 13 years later in, you know, the best sport in the world, you know, in the UFC fighting for a world title. I couldn't ask for anything better right now. Well, the fans should definitely come to see it live so they can, you know, see me fight and win it in person so they can say they actually were there. The other fighters come, you know, all different weight classes come into the fights and always support each other. So you might end up getting to meet one of your other favorite fighters. You know, I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming with everything I've ever learned in life, every bit of anger, every bit of happiness, every bit of joy, every bit of defeat. I'm taking it all to this moment so that I can come out ahead and I would be scared of me. Definitely hockey, even though I played basketball as a little girl growing up, like that was one of my sports, just because I, I love the aggression to it. I think a little, the little bit of the fighter comes out of me that I just love. <gasps> oh my gosh. This is incredible. Oh my god. Oh my god. I, my goodness. <gasps> You're already, already geared up for it. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Wow, CM Punk was gonna be so pumped. He's my buddy, so he's uh, he's gonna be pumped I got a jersey. These are incredible, thank you so much. You're definitely on the I-team now. <laughs>